interest in, even though you invest in a lot of uh, apparel, e-commerce, fashion companies, this is a little bit of a different approach to the industry on a personal level here with <laughs> yeah. you today. Not my daily so, life. Yeah, not your daily life. Yeah. So what's, how's that uh, been for you today? Really fun. I've always been a person that's respected the creative side of the fashion industry and, um, and enjoyed it for that. So the idea of being part of a photo shoot was exciting but more intimidating than anything. I think one of the most fun things about fashion is that um, it's this creative expression of yourself or your mood. And so I keep challenging myself to say, what is my style? Um, because my style sort of suits my mood. You know, some days I feel like wearing jeans and flats and I'm casual, and some days I wish I could have this outfit. <laughs> you know, in the investment business, you're dealing with companies that are people's dreams, that's pretty serious, and you have investors' money that you're representing, and that's pretty serious, so it's fun to have an aspect of it that's playful, and mm -hmm. that's creative in your day. So Saad, you're here, dressed with the best. <laughs> <laughs> well, how do, you, how do you feel? I don't know, I, found, I feel like I found my stilo, right? <laughs> um, no, this is fun, this is totally otherworldly. Clearly. You've been to some startups, you know what people wear. <laughs> it's like they wear like, you know, slippers and pizza. Board meetings you definitely like up your game a little bit. But yeah, the nice thing about the valley is you know, you roll around here uh, pretty much wearing whatever you want. Um, and at some level it's like the dorky or the t shirt, you know, the more street cred you got, right? So it's uh, it's fun. But it's what, what's actually really hard is when you leave here. So like I was in Istanbul recently, and like everyone is like suit, tie every day, and I roll it in my hoodie. And people are like, "Who is this guy?" So um, definitely had to make a couple of wardrobe changes. So Peter, you're not only a entrepreneur and investor and an advisor to companies, you also are into style and fashion yourself. I really love custom shirts actually and jackets because my body frame is a little bit different than most. Usually you kind of reserve those for uh, investor meetings or you know the important meetings uh, and you're always surrounded by entrepreneurs and kind of the t-shirts and the jeans. After today I feel inspired to dress up a little bit more. You know, dressing nice actually makes you feel pretty damn good. A lot of companies you invest in are in the sort of fashion apparel e-commerce space, yes. right? So yeah, we have a couple companies inside of Science right now down in Santa Monica where style is a big part of it. So whether that be kind of eclectic style, we have a company called Uncovet where the CEO is, you know, she's a, she's a style maven. The culture does help other people to kind of look up a little bit and, and change how they're dressing. So Tim, so in addition to being a really active and uh, you know successful technology investor, you also uh, have a lot of other things you're involved in. I've actually been a musician for much longer than a venture capitalist. I'm in a band called Black Mahal, which is a Punjabi hip hop band, if believe it or not. And we just went on tour, played the Montreal Jazz Fest, a huge personal achievement for myself. Got a little bass that was painted by one of our fans. It's pretty amazing. They. Uh, they like the music that they, and they painted this design wow. up here. That's incredible. You see all the themes that they weaved into it. So we wanted to talk to you about some of the style and what, what you did there. It's um, kind of crazy because doing the VC job and also playing in bands means you have to have a double wide closet. So you have workwear like this on one side and you have on the other side everything from leather pants, disco ball pants, fur vests, you know, all those sorts of crazy <laughs> outfits for, for wearing on stage. I'd love to like be confused one day and wear the wrong outfit or the wrong thing and see what happens and go into a you know a board meeting with the hot pink pants and see what happens. What do you like to wear just for yourself? Oh, I'm a bit of a clothes horse. So I'm a big fan of suits and designer jeans and well-tailored clothes. I admit I'd recently been on Pinterest and been very actively collecting sort of lookbooks and fashion ideas. But you know, I've learned more that the art of style is how you put things together and figure out your own configuration, sort of your own voice. Right, it's like what, what matches you and what, what fits right for you and what's your personal style. And it's like actually that. just like writing music or I'd probably say even being you know, a startup founder, it's like finding your unique voice. It might be a mashup of other elements, but it's your specific flavor.